you can find IoT in action almost everywhere these days. In healthcare, there are wearable devices like blood pressure cuffs, heart rate monitors, and glucose meters. Homes that use a smartphone app to adjust the thermostat. Commercial buildings are using IoT sensors to reduce power consumption, enhance safety, and lower maintenance costs. Farmers are using moisture sensors throughout the fields to direct irrigation where crops need it most. There are even so-called smart cities that have deployed a fleet of sensors to monitor road and traffic conditions. But what is IoT? IoT, or the Internet of Things, isn't a single device, software, or technology. Simply put, IoT is a network of dedicated devices, or things, used to gather and transmit real-world data through the Internet or other networks. What IoT does is give organizations real-time information and insights so they can make processes and operations more efficient, responsive, cost-effective, and secure. In the next few minutes, we'll get into the basics of IoT, its benefits, and what the future of IoT looks like. For a deeper dive, explore our complete collection of all things IoT by clicking the link above or in the description below. There are four key concepts to know about IoT. First, IoT is about the real world and IoT devices that reflect physical conditions in the real world. IoT is a technological evolution of RFID tags distributed through a factory that transmit information about machine conditions and material workflows. Data like this helps a business learn what's happening and also lets it exercise control over what's happening. The second key concept of IoT is immediacy. Data in a memo could exist for days or months without ever being used, but the data IoT devices collect is meant to be processed and used immediately. Cardiac data from a heart patient or pressure data from a nuclear reactor must be delivered and processed immediately. This immediacy makes things like network bandwidth, connectivity, and reliability very important. The third key IoT concept is data processing. It's all about how the data produced by IoT devices is processed and used by the business. IoT projects are often defined by the larger project or business purpose. In many cases, IoT data is part of a control loop with a straightforward cause and effect objective. The data sensors collect information from factory machines, for instance, and can be processed to find bottlenecks in maintenance and workflows. The fourth and final IoT concept is the scope of data and collection. The goal of IoT is to help businesses create a broad, detailed picture of an operational environment, such as a city highway system. Creating this picture can take hundreds or thousands of sensors of varying types and capabilities. An IoT device is a small, dedicated computer with an embedded processor, firmware, limited memory, and network connectivity. IoT devices are battery-powered and rely on wireless network connectivity. They can be configured individually or in groups. There's a second layer to IoT that has to do with connections, or the ways in which IoT data is moved from individual devices for collection and processing. The data collected and transmitted involves the broad network, typically a conventional IP-based Ethernet network. Every IoT device has a unique IP address and identifier. The device passes its data to the network using a wireless network interface, such as Wi-Fi or a cellular network. An IoT sensor fleet is the collection of IoT devices deployed by a business. This fleet of IoT devices produces an enormous volume of real-time data that's stored and collated at the IoT gateway, often located at the network edge. Then the data must be analyzed. IoT collects and transmits information that helps systems analyze, identify, and react to issues faster than any human could. But every IoT system does include some form of human interface. It can be an alert, a dashboard, big data analytics and reporting, or other form. This lets human operators keep watch and check on the behaviors of the IoT infrastructure. 
IoT's main benefits are knowledge and insight. It can help a sales manager forecast the next quarter's revenue, for instance, or a production manager decide whether to shut down a key machine in a vital production line for routine maintenance. IoT data lets managers and technicians respond to specific real-world situations in real time. But the real power of IoT is the long-term insights it provides through advanced analytics. The back-end computing processes that evaluate and correlate a huge quantity of seemingly unrelated data can answer business questions and make accurate predictions about future circumstances. One example is sensors distributed in a vehicle or industrial machine that can detect variations in operation and condition. This helps alert humans to the need for maintenance or warn of an impending failure. IoT might have big business benefits, but there are challenges to surmount when deploying any IoT project. For one, standards. With IoT project design, there is almost a complete lack of any international standards to guide the design and implementation of IoT architectures. And there's no rule book to refer to when starting an IoT project. That allows for a lot of flexibility in design, but it also opens the door to possible major design flaws. That's why having IT staff with IoT experience is essential. Also, data storage. There are enormous amounts of data that IoT devices produce. That data is a valuable business asset, but it must be secured, stored, and even destroyed properly. And IoT data is extremely time sensitive. Businesses need to invest in storage, security, and data retention and lifecycle management. When implementing IoT, there were some additional challenges around security. Control. Admins must be able to discover and control all IoT devices on the network. If there are undiscovered devices, ones that are unmanaged or orphaned, they might not provide useful data, but they may give hackers a weak point in your network to exploit. Device security. For IoT to be secure, each device must be properly authenticated and authorized. It's important to configure each device for least privilege or zero trust so that the access to IoT devices on the network is restricted to those who are essential to IoT operations. Strong passwords and network encryption for each IoT device is also essential for IoT security. Device updates are another challenge when deploying IoT projects. IoT devices are notoriously low bandwidth devices. So internal software updates can be time consuming, but ignoring or overlooking device updates gives hackers an open door. And network security. Organizations that implement IoT should also beef up their network security. For instance, by adding intrusion detection and prevention systems, comprehensive anti-malware tools, and strong data encryption. Segmenting the IoT network from the rest of the IT network is another move to consider. IoT's future is hard to predict because the technology and its applications are still fairly new. But there are six possible directions we can see now. One, there will be billions more IoT devices added to the internet over the next few years. Right now, there are over 15 billion, this is expected to double by 2030. Two, IoT security will become a key focus. Expect to see new initiatives in IoT security, starting with device design all the way through implementation. New legislation, regulations, and device defaults will emphasize end-to-end -end IoT data encryption. Established security tools like intrusion detection and prevention will include support for IoT architectures. And IoT device management tools will also emphasize security auditing to automatically address security weaknesses. Three, some aspects of AI and IoT will merge into what we might call the artificial intelligence of things. AIoT will blend the data gathering capabilities of IoT with the computing and decision making capabilities of AI. Four, 
AI use cases for IoT will diversify. Basic AI is already used to predict potential events, such as system failures, using real-time IoT data. Advanced AI will bring autonomy, such as adjusting a patient's insulin in response to dynamic blood glucose levels. Five, IoT data storage and processing at the edge will become more important to optimize network bandwidth and security. Six, and finally, vendors will likely offer platforms and services across the IoT stack. Market maturity will help speed the creation of new IoT deployments by removing complexity and making the design and deployment process more turnkey for businesses. Regardless of the actual directions, IoT will have a profound impact on businesses and IT well into the future.